Welcome back everyone. Today we're making Vasilopida. This is a traditional soft buttery Greek cake served over the New Year festivities. This cake has a lucky coin inserted into the batter and whoever receives the piece with the coin is said to have good luck for the following year. In certain regions in Greece, this cake is also presented as a brioche-like bread, but I'm doing the cake version today. So let's start off by greasing and lining our 10 inch cake pan. Once you've done this, set it aside. In a separate bowl, combine the all-purpose flour and the baking powder and stir well to combine. Set that aside. Now in the bowl of your stand mixer, add the butter and the sugar and cream this really, really well. The color has to change. It has to go almost pale white. Don't be afraid to scrape your bowl a few times during this process. Next up, uh, we're gonna be adding the eggs. We're gonna be doing these one by one. You wanna make sure that they're well mixed before you add the following one. Take your time doing this. There is no need to rush. We have to have a little patience with this cake. It does take a little bit of extra time to make, but the reward is worth it in the end. After the eggs have been incorporated, scrape down the bowl one more time. Add the vanilla extract or vanilla paste if you're using, followed by the freshly squeezed orange juice. Make sure that it is freshly squeezed and not from a carton. Add a very generous amount of orange zest. I actually used about the zest of three oranges for this cake. Next up, add the brandy. Why not? It's the new year. This will add a little bit of extra flavor. Now, once this has all come together, it's gonna to look like scrambled eggs and that the mixture has curdled. Don't be afraid. Once you've added the flour, as we are now, I like to do it in two to three batches, but um, mix it up as you go along after each flour addition and the batter will come out really smooth. Add the coin that's been wrapped up in aluminum foil and this is what the batter should look like at the end. Add the Vasilopita batter to the prepared cake tin. Give everything a good shake and smooth it out with a spatula. We're gonna bake this in the oven for one hour and once it comes out, we're gonna allow it to cool inside the tin. This can take up to two or three hours depending on your cooking environment. Now you can decorate it on top with a generous amount of powdered sugar or icing sugar like I have here. But you can also get fancy and add whole blanched peeled almonds to create the year or stencils of the year. It just depends. I've just gone for a simple version. Cut it out, serve it up and enjoy it. But most of all, have a happy new year. 